you feel like people can talk about work at church? Sometimes I don't hear that so much. There's great satisfaction in fixing stuff. I didn't do this for a really long time because interior design felt frivolous to me. When I was doing work, I was resettling refugees and I was doing a home ownership program for low-income families. I was doing like really meaningful work with the poor. So to do interior design felt so juju and frivolous and unnecessary. And um, But then it was kind of the thing that I had to do. I had to use my talents. But I really am shaping the way people live their lives. It's, it's easy to get caught up in the rigmarole mm -hmm. of ordering and scheduling it, but the people are, are what matters to me. Gotcha. You have to, everybody works. I like to interact with people and I provide for my family. I enjoy what I do. I enjoy, you know, I love cooking. I love being around people. It pays the bills. I have a huge passion for molecular genetics. It started way back in the day when I was in high school. I'd uh, learned about something called the Human Genome Project, and once I read about it, I realized that I had to be a part of this field. Oh, I work in order to pay my bills. I like to make money for my family so that they can get a good education, eat, and, and, and survive. We, we go, also, we do volunteer work. I try to teach my son uh, how to um, take care of other people that are less fortunate than we are and he will grow up and maybe teach his children how to do that. I just want to do something great and make a difference in the city, you know. By really pushing the frontiers of cutting edge medicine. And every time I'm doing a design, it's for someone else to live the next phase of their life together. How do you want to function? And let's make that function better and look more beautiful, but feel more like you so that you can feel not only comfortable in your own space, function better, but also be proud to show it to the world so you can have more people into your home because you're so proud of where you live. You don't try to impose your faith on people in an institution. It's not looked upon favorably. They really don't connect. At work you do what you what you say you do on Sundays, um, you know, as far as being fair and honest and things of that nature. Well, healing was a big part of, you know, Jesus' ministry, so, you know, you feel like you're in a, in a profession that are taking care of people. Oh, there's no <laughs> difference. No. Okay. That um, regardless of religion or beliefs, you know, there's a very certain protocol that needs to be followed. That said, there's a matter of why people do these, this work. I don't think there's a difference. Uh, if when people hear that I'm a Christian or they hear I uh, play the piano at church, you know, they start to judge you in your, in your actions. So I like to work in a credible way, in a way that represents Christ. Why do you think we don't talk about work? I mean, if we spend a third of our lives working, why do you think we don't talk about our work when we're together? as the church? Maybe because we don't want to think about it. <laughs>